Good morning, today we're down in Christchurch looking at a five axle Isuzu agitator truck operated by Mark Tamaru, who's an owner driver for Firth Concrete. It's actually the fourth anniversary today of the devastating Christchurch earthquake and there's clearly a huge demand in the city here for concrete and concrete products. Mark and his driver Kurt are still getting used to the new truck, but the best one to explain the finer details is Dave Wilson, sales manager for Black Bull's Isuzu. The, um, the truck itself is 350 horsepower uh, with a Allison 4300 series transmission. It's got Mirator diffs and axles, uh, which enables it to have full cross lock, lock up diffs and Hendrickson air suspension. Air suspension tag was fitted by Adams and Curry engineers here in Christchurch and uh, once 15 tonne of weight comes down on, onto that drive line, the axle goes down automatically and once the 15 tonne of weight is lifted off the drive line, as in once the agitator is empty, the axle comes up automatically as well. They are a wee bit lighter, they're an imported agitator of German design made in India and the whole setup was fitted up by ReadyMix Engineering at Belfast. Why doesn't this agitator have a subframe under the barrel? Uh, no need really, the, the depth of the chassis on the um, model allows it not to have a subframe and can be um, fixed straight to the chassis. So it's obviously putting a fair bit of load there at that point of the case. Yeah, yeah. These uh, are a new model. They were designed for the agitator market and also front loaders uh, for the New Zealand market. Whereas we used to put second steer axles under lighter chassis to do the job, but now they come complete as a unit. And is this Euro 5 or Euro 4? It's Euro 5. Euro 5. Yep. The Firth Concrete Plant is a busy place with lots of trucks coming and going at this time of day. Tippers and pneumatic tankers bring the sand, aggregate and cement to site where it is mixed and delivered by the agitator trucks. Leah Vartuitui is operating the batching console where each outgoing load is carefully mixed to the customer specifications. Trucks vary in size so she also has to ensure the trucks are loaded in the correct sequence and weight limits are not exceeded. That fifth axle is down when we're loaded, but it's barely obvious in normal driving. The 350 horsepower engine and six-speed Allison transmission provide good acceleration and allow the driver to concentrate on traffic. This load of concrete is the first of many to go into the foundations of the new Christchurch Justice Precinct buildings. It is a huge project and the first of several major government buildings that will form the heart of the new city of Christchurch. After the long drawn out process of building demolition and planning, things are finally happening in downtown Christchurch. These new buildings are built to a higher standard and require huge amounts of concrete to form a secure foundation. There is plenty of hard work ahead for the guys on the front line before the new city is finally ready to welcome its people home. <laughs> 